Hello everyone, this is Science in a Second, Mr. Jacob. I'm Mr. Jacob, here today to talk about conventionalism. Um, the really long version of that definition is a relationship between individuals of two species in which one species obtains food or other benefits from the other without harming or benefiting the latter. That's not what I want you to know. I want you to know something a little simpler. Um, one individual not affected and the other individual gains. What that means in short is uh, pretty much this right here. Where one species has no idea what's even going on and the other one gets the full benefits. Three examples of commensalism today is the first one we're going to talk about is metabiosis. Metabiosis is an example that is a hermit crab, the hermit crab with a shell. He swims along, loses, he drops his shell, and he gives it to a shrimp or gives it to other small animals for security. And the hermit crab has no idea what he's doing. He's just leaving the shell behind and the shrimp or fish or what have you end up benefit, getting the full benefits from it. The second we're going to talk about today is inquilinism. Inquilinism, an example of that, is an owl in a tree. The owl's flying around and sees the tree, sees a hole in the tree, and says, hey, man, that'd make me a really good home. And I think I'm going to use that for my home. So he ends up living there. And what that does, and what goes back to what we talked about a minute ago, with one benefits, is where the, the tree has no idea what's even going on because he's just a tree and the owl benefits. The third we're going to talk about today is foracy. Where the, bar or the sperm whale and the barnacles, where the barnacles catch a ride on the back of a whale and ride along through the ocean and the whale doesn't even have no clue whether they're there because they're so little and he's so big. Again, one has no clue what's going on, so he, the whale has no idea the barnacles are there and the barnacles get 100% of the gain because they're catching a ride and getting other food. Alright, to summarize the nomenclature and our definitions of what we learned today, uh, the first one was metabiosis. One species unknowingly makes a home for another species like the hermit crab and the shell. The second was inquilinism, one species using another species for a home. Uh, again, example of that was the tree and the owl. The third was forestay, one species gains travel from another species without affecting them, the sperm whale and the uh, barnacles. And this has been Science in a Second with Mr. Jacob. I'm Mr. Jacob, you all have a wonderful day. Listen to your mom and dad, eat your greens, and do good in school. Remember, everyone can learn.